Hello everybody. Um, it's been a while since I made a video. What was it? Uh, June 11th, I think, was the last video I made of the raccoons. I've been so busy lately, flying around the world in my Learjet and my boat, both at the same time. So it's okay. I'm um, just mocking somebody who seems to think that um, I'm a multi-millionaire because I worked as a um, debt collector and in student loans years ago. And um, seems to think that, um, you know, I've got a hell of a lot of money. Crazy. Um, the reason why I'm making this video today is because, I don't know if you know, and sorry about the noise, um, it's a fan at the back of me that I've got running because, you know, I don't like running the air conditioning and it's a little bit humid here, here in North Carolina, in my 40-bedroomed uh, mansion house, yeah. Um, alright, so back to what I was talking about, which was, right, the terms of service. The terms of service on YouTube has changed in regards to, um, the harassment and bullying. So, I'm wondering how some of these YouTube channels are going to survive they you know they've got millions of subscribers and you know they what they do is they just mock um, other youtubers and say funny things about them and you know they get hundreds of thousands of views because I, I think the reason why they got get the hundreds of thousands of views is because they're with networks um, Normally the people, if you look at somebody's YouTube channel and it's got the check at the side of the name, the check mark, the tick as they call it in England, that means verified. And I believe that the only way now that you can get that is if you are with a uh, network that YouTube rec recognizes. And I believe what your network does is it sends you, you know, or sends you a link to a... Um, website, you fill it out and it verifies you and it lets YouTube know that uh, you are who you say you are. And uh, you'll notice that a lot of these people that are verified, they have to check, you know, they've got hundreds of thousands, if not millions of subscribers, and they get, you know, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of views every time they put a video out. And you know, lots of people commenting and stuff like that. Um, okay. I'm kind of veering off track here, aren't I? It's the jet lag, you know. It's the jet lag. Lots of jet lag. Got lots of jet lag. And uh, just trying to find my land legs again after uh, having my sea legs. Okay. Alright, so. Um, where was I? Yes, okay. So... YouTube has changed its terms of service in regards to harassment and cyberbullying and there's quite a few channels out there that basically what they do is they use some of other people's other creators content and then they mock them um, look I'm all for freedom of speech and I think that you know the right of freedom of speech is basically to be offended and offend somebody you know um there are a lot of people that don't like to be offended but i think like shutting somebody down just because they're saying something um about somebody you know the way that they're doing it or you know why do you always wear that hat you know whatever it is whatever statement they're coming out with you know when you make your videos why do you always wear that hat so YouTube has changed its policy in regards to harassment and cyberbullying. And they're saying that they want people to use YouTube without fear of being subjected to malicious harassment. And in cases where harassment, 
crosses the line into a malicious attack and can be reported and will be removed and in other cases users may be mildly annoying or petty and should be simply ignored so what they're saying is if somebody's being petty and mildly mildly annoying that uh, you should ignore them and youtube goes on to say that harassment may include abusive videos comments and messages so anybody that's been abusive towards another youtuber or youtubers um the good possibility they could lose the channel or get suspended or something um other harassment includes revealing someone's personal information maliciously recording someone without their consent deliberately posting uh, content in order to humiliate someone uh, making hurtful and negative comments videos about another person unwanted sexualization which encompasses sexual harassment or sexual bullying in any form and incitement to harass other users or creators so there I'll put a link to this in the about section of I'll actually copy the text and put it in the about section um, along with the link and it gives some tips and advice it says pause before you post think seriously about how you may be perceived online and do not post anything that may compromise your reputation or safety speak up tell friends to stop cyberbullying bullying and voice your opinion against cyberbullying when you see it on the site tell an adult if you remain concerned about another's actions towards you online try deleting comments and blocking the user if another user is bothering you so they can't view your videos or leave more comments you can also turn comments off for any video or manage comments by requiring pre-approval before they get posted respect pe people's opinions online but know when it crosses the line we want YouTube to be a dynamic and expressive platform but we do not want users to feel intimidated or threatened report harassing users and content via YouTube's reporting tool and this tutorials is you know linked there um, also it goes on the bottom it says sometimes criticism and insults can escalate into more serious forms of harassment and cyberbullying if specific threats are made against you and you feel unsafe tell a trusted adult and report it to your local law enforcement agency so there we have it YouTube has changed its terms of services who knows what's gonna happen here with certain YouTube channels because like I've said there are a good number of YouTube channels that do make a good amount of money by creating content based off what other people are saying on their videos basically mocking them and mimicking them and making fun of them now if people who they're doing that to uh, are now aware of this they might then now turn around and say you know what I'm not having this I'm not having this person mocking me um, and they might file a complaint or you know somebody else may file a complaint or if enough people file a complaint even if it's I believe comments if people are making comments nasty comments about people um, disclosing people's personal information and things like that people I think are gonna start to be losing YouTube channels um, yeah so I just wanted to let you people know that watch my videos and anybody that shares this and doesn't know about it and gets gets to see this videos video that um, this is what uh, YouTube is about or is doing right now so 
All right, um, I gotta go because the pilot is waiting for me in my Learjet, uh, which has the boat attached and the helicopter attached to it at the airport. So I've got to go and spend some of my money that, that you know, those billions of dollars that I've earned. So be good, peace, and uh, take care of yourself. And uh, I'll try to make some more videos every day hopefully peace